Alright ladies, I'm going to show you how to edit a label for an invitation and then how to print it from Avery.com. So you're going to go to edit and then you're going to pick the label that you want and here's what pulls up. You're going to go over here to this little wand and then you're going to scroll all the way down until you see draw. You're going to click on draw and this brings up an eraser. So now I'm going to go over here and I'm going to click on this and very carefully erase the details of this party. And when it gets down to something smaller, I'm going to show you what you can do because you have to be very careful. You don't want to erase too much. So right over here, if you go down, it decreases your brush size. So now I'm over here and I can erase them a little bit smaller. So I can do that and that. Okay. And then you're going to hit apply. Okay, so you're done with that. Now you're going to go to text. And then you're going to pick a font and click on add text. So now I'm going to say Julie um, Smith. And I'm going to highlight it. And then I want to change the font to pink and bold. And I want to make it just a little bit bigger. And then I'm going to take it and I'm going to move it up here. And you can make it as big as you want to make it look right and move things around. So Julie Smith is having a party now. And then you can go down here and you can make this fun. <clears throat> So click on anything that you want, put Julie's party and highlight it again. And then you can go down here and put that in there and you can make it a little bit smaller so that it fits in there right. Just like that. And you'll do the same thing over here, okay? So then you'll take your um, invitation, it's not done, but it's done for our purposes. And then you're going to go over here, you're going to save it onto your Facebook, onto, or I mean onto your desktop, okay? So I saved that picture. Now I'm going to go to Avery.com and I'm going to click on Design and Print. Now I'm going to go here and click 5163. That is my 2x4 labels that I use. And so it's going to bring up this page. I'm going to click on blank and text only right here. And I'm going to double click on the blank one. And it pulls up my label. Now I'm going to click on images from my computer. I'm going to go to my desktop where I saved the picture of the label and I'm going to click on the label and then I'm going to increase the size just like that and here's my label. Now all I have to do is go to preview and print, click on print, it's going to pull up a PDF for you. You put your labels into your um, printer, click on open this, and the only thing you have to remember is unclick fit to page, and then print how many labels you want. It's really, really easy to do. Hope that helps.